I'm attracted to a female. Or like, you know, it's for today, I'll be heterosexual. And then after the next year, I'm like, oh my God, I would really love some dick. I'll be like, okay, you know I'm gonna get myself some tape because you know what? For today, beautiful people of the world, how are you guys doing? Are you king and queening? Um, thank you for watching my video. If you're new, well, you probably are new because this is literally like my second video. Please hit that subscribe button because it really would mean the world to me, and I would even appreciate it even more if you turn on the post notification bell. So today's video is a video that is really, really interesting. I think this is the most interesting topic of the 21st century. And it is sexuality. Oh, and remember, this is a safe space where we share ideas, no judgment, no negativity. So if you have an idea that you want us to talk about, please leave it in the comment section. And if you have a take or a different view from what I'm going to say, please comment section and let us communicate. And remember, let's be positive. So, ooh, I thought too fast. So, um, today's topic is, is interesting. Like, you know, I feel like as a human race, we feel we are boxing ourselves. We're putting ourselves in a box of being heterosexual or homosexual. Heterosexual is being, is like when you are straight and then homosexual is when you are gay or lesbian being attracted to the same sex. You know, and while we, 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 we are not opening ourselves to other kinds of sexualities, I mean, we have bisexual, we have transsexual, we have demisexual, we have great sexual, we have sepiosexual, we have all, we have asexual, we have all these different sexualities that I think as a humanist we should explore and try out. I know that your sexuality is something that you're born with and you cannot change it, but then like guys, let us, let us try other things. I mean, honestly, if, if I wake up today and I'm like, oh my goodness, so I'm not attracted to any kind of gender, I'll be like, you know what, today I am um asexual and then tomorrow if i wake up and be like oh my goodness i want some pussy and like i'm attracted to a female or like you know what for today i'll be heterosexual and then after the next year i'm like oh my god i would really love some dick i'll be like okay you know what i'm gonna get myself some dick because you know what for today i am homosexual and then the next time like oh my god i want both dick and pussy at the same time i'll be like you know what for today i am bisexual you know and if the next day I wake up and I'm like, oh my god, I would really, really love to have a sex with a transsexual, well, transgender person. I will come my as transsexual because I am open to all these ideas and trying out other things. I mean, I haven't personally done any of things, those things yet. But as I'm growing, I am learning more and I'm opening myself more to those ideas because boxing myself in a little... In, in boxing myself to, 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 to just homosexual and heterosexual is really, really, like, it's, it's being small-minded. And, like, I'm open to trying out new ideas, new things. You might think I'm crazy. You might disagree with, with what I'm saying. But you know what? We are in the 21st century. There's never been a better time to be yourself. So I honestly feel like we should, like, at least, like, let, 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 let's live a little. Let's try this thing out. I mean, like... Really, and like if, if you care about what other people think or will say, just think to yourself, be like, you know what, in two years time, more people really care about what I did today, you know, because they will, they will probably not even remember or care about what you did. Like, so if you want to go for something, just go for it, do it for yourself. Because if you live your life thinking about people, you're not going to get any far in life. I mean, like, let's be real now. Do you think that people still remember all the things you did in high school? No. Do you still think that people care about all the wrong things you did in primary school? <sighs> no. So if you want to live and enjoy life, do it. Because do it for yourself. Be open for yourself. Try out. Like, be fluid. Like, come on. I feel like this is what we should do as a human race. And yeah, like that is all I have for today's video. I really, really, really hope you learned a thing or two about sexuality. And if you want me to talk about more about sexual related topics, come on. I am here as your life coach. Hey now. So, and guys, don't be afraid to embrace your sexuality. Don't be. Don't be. Don't be. Be proud of who you are. Be proud of how sexual you are. If you are very sexual, that's fine. It, it's fine. It's human nature. If you are not that sexual, it's human nature. If you're not sexual at all, that's also fine. It's who you are. That what makes you you. So be proud of who you are and stand up for yourself. Because if you don't do it, ain't nobody gonna do that for you.
okay oh my god i, I kind of got a little stroke there so yeah um thank you for watching my video i really hope that you learned a thing or two and you you you're gonna be more open to trying out new things and sexually and yeah give me that like give me that comment give me that subscribe because it it would really mean something to me you know i really 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 appreciate your view and mwah, thank you see you soon well tomorrow because i'll post another video tomorrow since i post every day yeah bye